Okay, hi Virgo, welcome back to my channel. Guys, if you're new here, welcome. And if you are returning, thanks so much for supporting the channel. So we're going to go ahead and get your daily affirmation for today. Let's see what the energy is like. Now, this is a general message. It may not resonate for everyone. So take the parts that resonate for you and leave the rest, okay? So let's get you a Moonology card and see what the message is from there. So what is the daily affirmation for the sign of Virgo? Thank you, Spirit, show me. What do we have for Virgo? For the sign of Virgo. There's a message here that will create motivation. That will create inspiration. So that we can see elevation. All right. Give me one card for Virgo. What is the most important message here? What's the energy for the collective? Show me. Oh, okay. So your card for today, Virgo, it says, Oh, confidence is the key to success. It says new moon in Leo. And I think our last moon was in Leo. So for some of you, it is giving me the energy here. There may have been something that you needed to take action on, maybe from the moon gone here. So this may be an energy of um, delays, but it could be due to, like it says, someone's confidence level. So let's see. New moon in Leo. So number 50, which may be significant to someone here. Again, you know, the 50, if I had to take away the zero and leave the five, it talks about it's time for change here for someone. Hence that action energy. So let's see, 50. Confidence is the key to success. It says this card hurdles the start of a new cycle for you. When you're going to look and feel more gorgeous, it says more in the spotlight, more like you have something worth showing off. It, say, it says if you want someone's attention, this card says it's coming. It says, however, this may not happen all by itself. You have to be willing to do your bit. That means being proud of who you are and what you have to offer. It says, think of yourself as the king or queen of the jungle and carry yourself accordingly. It says, this card is also a great omen if you're asked about a creative project it says you're working on. Alternatively, it can be heard. It can be heard. Good news or a new start for your children. Okay. So if you are approached with something here today, and I'm not even going to lie, for some of you, this may have to do with romance. It doesn't have to be, right? With um, a new romantic cycle begins at the bottom of the deck. But it could definitely be, you know, some kind of business opportunity coming towards you. Um, but this is saying you've got to step into that energy of um, the queen of wands, the king of wands. It's almost like that energy, hey, you're going to do something, do it well. So let's get one from the Life Loves You. What is this for? Thank you, Spirit. The sign of my Virgos. Or whoever else may be watching. Ah, okay. So you have I Love My Body. So some of you may be worried about how you look and things like that. Um, it says... Do a downward dog. <laughs> I don't know what that is. <laughs> um, it, it, I don't know. It may be like a, a some kind of a dance or something like that because it says take a dance class, book a foot massage, be kind to your body. Do a downward dog. I'm almost tempted to Google it, but <laughs> leave a comment down below if you know what it is. Okay. Um, it almost sounds like maybe a yoga position as well. Meditation, maybe? A downward dog. Virgos, <laughs> that's what I have for you for your daily affirmation. So, guys, again, you know, hit that thumbs up for me. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. But if this is where we part, stay safe, love and light, Virgos.